channel. This is going to be our Positano vlog. So we are still currently in Capri, which is an island like 45 minutes away by boat from Positano. So we've been here for three days, three, four days. I did also film our trip here. So if you guys haven't seen that, I will have a link down below, but we were here on our honeymoon and it's been absolutely gorgeous. So today we're going to Positano. We've just packed up everything in our room and we're quickly gonna go have breakfast and then make our way down to the port. And we're gonna be in Positano for three days. It's our friends Mimi and Alex wedding vow renewal ceremony. They're having their event there. And tonight there's a dinner, tomorrow it's the ceremony, and then the last day is a farewell lunch. So yeah, we're very excited about that. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna be filming of like all of the events. I definitely want to talk to everyone and mingle and just like be really in the moment, but definitely around like the other things that we're doing. It is going to be our first time in Positano, so I'm very excited to discover it and just like see, because I've heard so many things about it. So I will take you guys along and show you what we do. And yeah, hope that you guys enjoy this video. Just got to breakfast and I was thinking I'm definitely gonna miss this view. It's been so beautiful. gotten ourselves changed into our bathing suits. We have a reservation today at Azanzo. Oh gosh, I can't remember the name. Azanzo Beach, I think that's how you say it. We have reservations there for lunch and we've got beach beds, but we ended up coming in a little bit later than we expected. So it's already, I think, 2.30ish now. And we have our dinner with our friends tonight. I think it's at seven. So we're not gonna be there for too long, but we're definitely gonna go there, have lunch, enjoy a little bit. And um, yeah, Positano is so beautiful so far. The views here are just incredible. You guys saw when we came in with the boat. It looks so, so stunning. By the way, I've got on this cute little scarf. This was actually one of Mo's gifts for me for my birthday. And I've got on my new black bikini from Boy Show. This is the one that goes like that. Just like a simple black design. And my Misoma necklaces. So yeah, I'm excited for today. This is the view from our hotel. It's so beautiful, wow, amazing. So that's where we arrived earlier today and we are going to a beach over on that side. So there's two beaches here, one here and one here. That's what we saw 
from our arrival but the one as I mentioned that we're going to is a little bit further down on that side so we actually need to get a taxi to go there but the ones that are down here you can just walk to them by foot I think it takes like 10-15 minutes to walk down okay we've just arrived at the beach this is the furthest they can take us and we have to take little stairs to get to where we need to go this is our view absolutely incredible I was thinking like, to bring my my Birkenstock, but I forgot. And all the beaches here have stones. There aren't any. There's no sand anywhere, so they all look like this, this kind of style. But it's so beautiful. You have this big rock wall here. And it goes all the way around, and then it looks like this on the other side. It's so cute. You have little houses up there, even palm trees. So cute. Okay, we've ordered some food. This is the first course. Mo got this caprese salad with mozzarella and tomato, and I got green salad with some tomatoes, and then we have our main course coming soon. Just went for a little swim. Ah, it's so nice and refreshing. We've had some food, some drinks, some right. desserts. It's really nice. So baby, what do you think about this place? Yeah, cool. Something I miss is like music, <laughs> right? But it's nice, I like it. And the water is super good. Yeah. How often does the taxi boat come? Every 20 minutes. Okay. It's coming back in 20 minutes? Yes. The time we go to Pakistan, I come back. Ten minutes to the boat for the town, and ten minutes for the Okay, so we definitely have to get on that one. There were a lot of stairs coming down to this little beach. So we took a taxi here, but now we're going to take a boat to go back to the port of Positano and then walk up to our hotel. And I don't know how many stairs are going to be there, but we'll see. <laughs> Apparently I heard there are a lot of stairs to get back up to the hotels and stuff, but it's relaxing now, taking in this chill, chill atmosphere and these beautiful views. And then we are going to go back to the hotel room, get ready. I'm going to wear my new white set, if you guys saw from our Capri vlog, from the local designer that I found there, the two-piece like top and bottom, because it's an all-white event tonight, so I'm going to wear that. Yeah. We're gonna chill a little bit more and then we'll see you at the room. Okay, it's time to go. Okay, most pick the front. Let's take a picture. Huh? <laughs> Let's picture. use the picture. <laughs> Oh, this is beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Wow. Gorgeous.
How was it? So nice. It's so beautiful. So just put my little sarong. Okay. We're currently making our way back to the hotel. Feels like we've walked like 10,000 stairs already. <laughs> so many stairs. But I love it. Okay, it's good that we're just getting in the shower after this. <laughs> this is like intense. I'm sweating. How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> it's fine. Okay, we are back in the room. We're about to head out. That was, by the way, one of the best showers I've ever taken. <laughs> we were so sweaty. Okay, but these are our outfits of the night. So tonight is an all white theme. And he's wearing Zimama. It's, almost, it's a Capri Zimmerman. So this is the dress that I got from Capri. Um, was it like two days ago now? And really love it. I think I have to do a close-up of the details because I don't know if you guys can see from there. But yeah, it's a nice two-piece. Mom's wearing all white, looking dashing. So my jeans is, um, I think it's from Zara. But I have pimped it myself a little bit. I made some details. It was not like that. It was a normal plain oh. white so jeans. So you, you cut the holes? Yeah. So I created some like, you know, some art on every edge a little bit. So it's okay. It has these details. Anyway. Nice. My my shirt is from Dior, um, and my glasses from Frey. My shoes from Laura Piano. Very nice. You look great. All right. Okay, wait, let's see if you can see my details a little better. So it's got this nice like eyelet detail and it's got a little like lacy design on it. I really love it. I feel nice and comfy and I've got my little Chanel bag and then my easy Valentino sandals. Okay, we're back at the stairs. <laughs> Going back down shouldn't be as intense. So guys, we are here at Mimi and Alex renewal. It's so pretty. So this is the welcome dinner. By this the way. is the welcome dinner. It's the first day. The whole setter. Cool. Okay, we've just come inside the hotel to find some AC because it's so hot. <laughs> Literally, Mo is just blowing his shirt. <laughs> It's so hot. It's really his, hot. His shirt is like wet. <laughs> you know, normally they have even these. Yeah. <laughs> Not even this is here. But it's a beautiful hotel. Oh my god. It's yeah, so it's cute. so cute. I, mean, I don't know how the rooms. I think it's still too early. <laughs> I need Come stand outside. We have circulating air here. I'm taking over. Good job. Good job. Okay. here tonight and for these next few days to join us to celebrate uh, most importantly to celebrate love friendship and after you know the last whatever time we had I think every day is so special so I'm really excited and grateful for each of one of you coming here tonight so thank you honestly what a dream having all of you guys here it seemed almost like an impossible task so I'm extremely grateful that we all made it here safe and sound and healthy most importantly and um, really extremely excited to celebrate with you guys love in general not just our love but like Alex said I think what's important now is just to raise global vibrations and focus on all the good things in life love you all thank you for being here Coming. Good morning. Good morning. How's it going? How did you sleep? So good. I like the room here a lot better than at in Capri. The pillows were nice and soft. <laughs> the sheets were good. Yeah. And yeah, I but slept really good. We just ordered breakfast and we're sitting here with this incredible view. So pretty. Again, it doesn't feel real. It's almost like you want to touch it and like 
you're gonna feel a painting right now. See all the little boats down there. And I love the pink flowers too. Just think about all that houses, how they have been built into the stone. Yeah. I mean, they really had to, I don't know, cut the stones to make a real clear fundament. Yeah. So that's not that easy, I would say. And you see some are really standing in the rock. Hopefully you guys can see that, but the structures here are just incredible. And we were talking to someone yesterday and they were saying how they built all of this before they even had electricity and proper machinery and stuff so it's it's really incredible and it's held up for so many years so so pretty so last night we attended the welcome reception welcome dinner and it was at the palazzo murat hotel really cute really beautiful big courtyard space where they held the event and it was so nice to meet everyone we just chatted away and that's why we didn't vlog but it was really nice they're all so kind and i love to meet like-minded people you know through friends because we all then share like a similar you know group of values kindness and passion for life and for work and, and everything like that so that was really nice and we've also just in general i feel like we've met a lot of people here like everyone's very open chatty welcoming a lot of people from the u.s as well i feel like we've met most of the people that we've connected with have been from new york or los angeles oh, no. so that's been fun too for us that's exotic <laughs> you know <laughs> for, for them we're exotic <laughs> back at the stairs we're making our way down to the town just to check it out and see what's going on it's 35 degrees yeah it's very hot hello hi hi so cute you guys are so cute where to go, what we, we to do, do here. We, I mean, but I'm sure there's nothing to shop here, but it's like all these beach areas, you can have a look. Yeah. And you can see yeah. also the sand is dark. I guess it's because of um, the whole dark stones that they have here. The first half of the beach on the top is sand, but it looks like it's just like crushed, <laughs> crushed small black stones that are closer to the water. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it's interesting to just discover a new place. This looks cute too. Even this little bathroom changing area is really cute. I think these are all like private little um, cabins that you can go in and freshen up from being at the beach. And here is one of the beaches. So cute. Going back to the hotel now. These guys are amazing. You should definitely 
yeah. check this guy out. <laughs> and uh, tra their travel uh, Instagram is amazing. Like, just check it out. Their profile. Hey, yeah, we'll link it down below. Oh, okay. We're gonna be watching this episode now. <laughs> well, like, is there any anything you would l would love to tell us, or some no, no something for for our subscribers? Alex is the creator. Alex and Mimi are the creator of the Five Minute Journal. You guys, you all know the Five Minute Everyone Journal. Everyone knows it. This is where it all started with this beautiful human right here. Yes. One tip. Just when you wake up in the morning, think one thing that you're grateful. That's it. That's how I Love changed it. my life. It's Simple. literally with that. You don't even need a five minute journal. <laughs> all you do is wake up. Structure. Yeah, all you do is wake up in the morning. As soon as you open your eyes, what am I grateful for? You create yes. that habit, you create that habit, you change your life. Yes. Love it. Okay, we just left Alex and our friends. We are now rushing back to the room to get ready for the wedding. Here's Mo. We're not taking the steps right now, we're taking the same way obviously, but it's we're taking on the, the main road. <laughs> My legs are feeling good, you guys. Like I'm enjoying this. I think if you're gonna be here for just a couple of days, definitely get a hotel at the top because that way you can enjoy the view and the beautiful scenery. But obviously if you're here for a longer time, like a week plus, maybe get something like down in the town. Cause then it might be a bit much, you know, like walking it several times a day. Or if you like the challenge and the exercise, then why not? Happened. It was so beautiful. It was so beautiful guys. I mean first of all the location is insane We're in Ravella right now. I don't know what this garden is called, but Mimi was it's saying Villa Kimbare or something like that Yeah, Mimi was saying that this is one of the only gardens I think in the world where they have kept the same plants and the same way of planting and the design of the park as they did in the 18th century. It's really, really special. Mm. And the trees here are incredible. And the, and view. the setup was insane, like where the ceremony happened, like the view to the water was spectacular. Yeah. I had so many tears in my eyes. Same. And I was just Sorry. trying to not start crying. But um, yeah, it was so nice. Yeah. And now um, we're walking back. And we're gonna have dinner now. Have dinner now.
everything and do as much as we could so I think yeah we're definitely ready for calm but it's been really really fun if you guys are ever thinking of coming to this region I would definitely say Mo and I both enjoy Capri a lot Pastano was nice but I think if you're gonna come here definitely um, check out Capri it's very beautiful and cute like less crowded it has a really nice vibe to it just in general I think during the day you definitely have to check that you don't um, that you don't go somewhere where it's really hot like in the city a stroll makes no sense so you no. should during the day go to the beaches just enjoy on the water get a boat or anything like that mm -hmm. go to the Faraioni and like just experience Capri from the outside and uh, the day starts actually around five six o'clock and then open end that's when the most people start going out because before that it's really too hot yeah it is also end of july so it's super super hot i think this is one of the hottest times of the year including august but if you come like in the springtime the weather's still really nice but it's not going to be as hot yeah but that's the time where we are and it was very hot like especially going up the stairs at the end in positano i was i mean there was water in places and there were it, like my sweat was just like took 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 like droplets big droplets <laughs> really crazy but a nice experience it was fun to finally see this part of the world because it's some place that Mo and I have always talked about coming to but um, yeah, we just never had. Ravello was nice. I mean, we didn't see mm -hmm. Ravello in total, but we saw Ravello the uh, Villa Kimbroni. We are grateful for this trip. Uh, we are happy to go back. We are happy to work a little bit our ass off. Because, uh, <laughs> work a little our ass off, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we have some fun things launching soon. So yeah, just kind of getting back into our routine. It's mm -hmm. funny, like when you're away, I mean, for me now, I'm ready. I'm, I'm ready to go back home. We are going to end up this vlog. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out. It was nice to see you. And see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.